If you're looking for some information on twice confirmed traffic, I've got it here. Now, I've used twice confirmed traffic in my business, and I'm going to show you proof of everything that I'm talking about here. So, I use twice confirmed traffic in my business to generate leads, and what I'm going to do in this review is show you my results for it so you can decide for yourself whether it's a uh, a good traffic source for you or not. So, but I'm going to compare it to also classified submissions because I've tested both of them. And what I wanted to do was to find a traffic source that was passive, but also would generate leads um, constantly for my business. So the question I'm going to answer here in this video is: um, twice confirmed traffic versus classified submission. That's another traffic source, and pretty much which one is better. So I'm going to go and show you my tracking stats, you know, my tracking link to show you the results I've had with both of these. So you can see that this is not fluff, that, you know, I've used them both, and then you can make an assessment, in a sense, for yourself, which one's better. And I'll certainly give you my opinion on both of them as well at the end of the video. So Twice Confirmed Traffic, you've probably already seen it. This is the page for Twice Confirmed Traffic. Um, it's an interesting page. You know, it has an interesting claim in terms of how they generate their traffic and what their traffic does. Pretty much the premise is, you know what, they buy traffic in bulk and they market a certain product to the traffic or whatever product they want and if the traffic buys their product then they pass it on to the members on this platform here so they could buy, buy and use that traffic and if people on the platform are getting sales from that traffic as well then it becomes twice confirmed. So what they do then is go back to the traffic source that they got that traffic from and just buy a whole more of it because that traffic source is a good one for the entire group here. So, you know, you you probably read through all this already. This is the very same page. So you can see that, yeah, this is the same page we're both talking about um, with twice confirmed traffic. So that's twice confirmed traffic. Now, the other traffic source that I mentioned that I would talk about is called classified ad submission. And these two I kind of compare because they both have the same things that I wanted. And I wanted to see if I could use both of them or to see if, well, maybe one's better. So what classified submission does is it blasts out your link. So whatever you're advertising, you know, whatever business, whatever lead capture page, whatever you're advertising, they will blast that link out to you for you. So instead of you going personally to all these free sites and directory sites and, you know, creating an account, logging in, you know, creating the ad and sending it out, you just do it on the site once and they blast it out for you. Um, without you doing all that hard work of constantly going to sites and logging in, creating accounts, and blasting it. Because that's very time consuming. So you can come here. I'll put a link in the description box. You know, you can certainly come here and check this out as well if you're not familiar with this one. So you could get a good comparison of both of them. So let's get into the meat of this. Um, how do they compare? So my link tracking stats, and I have a marketing system that allows me to track my what's happening with my business here. So for classified submissions, what I did, you can see the name is called classified submissions. I use a tracking link. I create a tracking link in my marketing system here that's called CS. So stand for classified submissions. Then um, for twice confirmed, I use, so it's called twice confirmed traffic. I use a key keyword or a traffic kind of um, tag as TCT, twice confirmed traffic, to signify that that's the tracking link I'm using to track how this traffic is performing. So you got both of them here. So this, I'm going to blow it up here. I kind of took it and I'm just going to blow it up so you can see it a lot better here. So you can see my CS, that's classified submissions. I had 1,500 hits. I had 148 completed the survey that means they opted into my lead capture page and so my tracking stat is saying that's a nine pretty much a ten percent response rate of getting fifteen hundred people to see this opt-in that's a ten percent response so that's for classified submission now I'm gonna go compare it to twice confirmed now with twice confirmed I use a tracking link TCT you can see my tracking link right there and I got five hundred and twenty five hits now that that right tweak something because I, I've tried tw twice confirmed 
traffic and it looked like something was goofy and I thought okay maybe I wasn't marking and something correct so I changed things up a little bit and so that's currently what it was um, let's see here I'll get this page kind of short and I'll get this over so you can see that <clears throat> this is 2018 so this is real current stuff this is not from years ago you know way back when so maybe way back when things were good but right now 2018 this is what I'm seeing here. So if you look right above here, you'll see that I have other links in here. So this is from a different traffic source that I tested. The very same page. I had 300 people come to this same page, and I had 119 opt-ins. This is the same page I'm testing here. I had 130 people come here, 57 opt-ins. With the tri twice confirmed traffic, I have 500 people come to this site, the same page here and zero opt-ins. Now I find that to be very bizarre. Now I'm going to show you one more thing here because this wasn't the first time I tested it. I tested it before and I gave it a fair shake. You know, it's not like I said, oh, you know, I'm just going to do it for a day or so and see what happens. I definitely gave it enough time to see and tweak my process enough to see, okay, is it me or is truly the traffic is really that bad? So you be the judge here. So this is twice confirmed traffic, and I put the date uh, 12, December 1, because that's when I really started testing this, to, to now January 2018. And you can see over time I had 4,000 hits to this one opt-in page, which is the same page I'm using to advertise with these other places I'm testing. And this traffic site, that TCT, twice confirmed traffic, I have zero opt-ins. So my conclusion is, getting to this, I mean, I can't prove it, but you know what? This traffic looks like it's fake traffic. There's no way possible that 4,000 people, real people, could go to a website where 300 goes to the same website. I get opt-ins, but on the same page, not one single person is curious enough to put in their email address to get the information that I have. So my conclusion is, Price confirmed traffic to classified ad submission. Classified ad submission blows them away, just out of the water. Now, twice confirmed traffic co will cost you about sixty dollars per month. That's what I paid for it, around sixty dollars per month. So I'm looking to cancel this because this is not doing me any good. I'm getting zero opt-ins, no need testing it anymore. There's no more, no more tweaking I want to do with this because it's like you know what? If I can't get it to work after four thousand hits, it's just not going to work for me. Now this one, classified submission, that one costs $39.99, so pretty much 40 bucks a month. And so these are both passive kind of uh, traffic sources. So this one gave me results, and I'm going to put this in perspective of what, how I looked at the results that I got with classified submission. Now typically if I was going to buy solo ads, so if you go out there and buy a solo ad, a solo ad would run you, yeah, about 40 bucks for 100 clicks. You get 40 bucks for 100 clicks. And actually, you know what? Let's do it over here. So you get 100 clicks. You're going to pay about 40 bucks, right? So 100 clicks, and that's 100 clicks. And if your response rate or opt in rate is about 30%, so for every 100 people you send to that page, you're going to get 30% opt in. That means you're going to get 30 leads. Now, here is the thing with classified ad submissions. I got 148 leads for the same $40 that I spent. I would have spent in a solo. So this would be a solo ad. If I spent the solo ad, I'd get about 30 leads because that's the conversion of that page. With classified ad submission, that $40 translate into 148 leads. So that is an awesome return in terms of how I'm getting uh, for my um, <clears throat> lead generation process here. So I'll show it to you again here that that's what it was. <clears throat> now even though for me it's saying you know like 1500 hits and I got 148 to fill out the survey and that's a 9% conversion rate. What I'm looking at is you know what I spent just 40 bucks for this thing so forget about the hits. What I'm thinking you know the hits doesn't matter. Out of everything that I spent at <clears throat> $40 I got 148 leads. So this one is a winner, hands down.
if I had bought a solo ad for the same amount of price, I would have gotten maybe 30 opt-ins, could be 40 opt-ins. This is way more than spending a solo ad. The only thing with these is um, it is, you know, passive traffic. So it's not going to come in like a floodgate. It's just going to trickle in over time, which is perfect for me in terms of what I want to happen in my business. I want the traffic to come in constantly over time. And it seems like, you know, with the classified submissions here, I'm getting a lot more opt-ins over time than just going out there trying to blast the solo ad, getting 30 opt-ins, and then keep doing it over and over. So, you know, if this, my final, I guess, um, assessment of this is, you know, twice confirmed, not going to do that again. It gave me um, no response, absolutely zero. Out of all that traffic that went to that site, zero. So that one d just doesn't work. I see no way in heck that this is going to work ever. Classify that submission, very promising here. Um, getting 148 leads, just spend 40 bucks. You can cancel the service whenever you want, um, continue with, change things up. I figure this is the best way to go. So my thing is thumbs up to classify it. Submissions, thumbs down, double thumbs down, triple thumbs down to twice confirmed traffic. I think the traffic is definitely fake. So you be the judge. I showed you all my information here that I generated in terms of um, the data. Um, check it out. Now, I will post a link in the description here of classified submissions. So you can go check it out if it seems like it could be a fit for your business. And just read it over. And you could certainly... You know, read it over. I think you could just join it. You don't have to go right into it. But um, what I like is that they do have a guarantee uh, of some kind of process happening. So go ahead. You know, if you're interested in looking at this um, as a possible traffic site, the links are all in the description box.